and welcome back to my youtube channel for a new video and in this video i'm going to show you like how i've set this planner up i know i did it like a setup video in late december but i wanted to show you some things that i've created so far like a vision board uh, i decorated my name page and a few other things so that's what i'm going to show you today so first up we have this like the inside of the cover. I put this big like mambisic uh, right here. I did this last year as well and I really like to have like a quote to come back to uh, that I can read like all year and I think that this everything is going to be okay. It's very fitting for 2021. Hopefully we get the vaccine and things can start to go back to normal again and so that's why I put this one here. Then we have my name page. If you follow me on Instagram, I posted this a while back, a picture of this and I love it so much. I was pretty bored one day during my winter vacation and I just started to add these like black details to the florals on this page. And then I thought, and I had this picture um, that I had, I had printed it to put in my journal, but I didn't use it because I had too many pictures. So I took this picture and added it to the name page. And I also added a few die cut stickers uh, that I've got from Create with Mandy. So I really like this. And I think I'm going to add a few more things later on, like during the year. Some more die cut stickers and stuff like that so I'm really loving this page and I'm loving the color scheme of it or color scheme so yeah very beautiful so this is the year at a glance and then we have my one little word for 2021 and it is presence so I printed these like quotes and sayings from Pinterest so these are pictures from Pinterest that I just printed uh, and I put them on this like regular note paper and all of these like I search for presents and quotes on Pinterest <laughs> so uh, all of these quotes has with presents and being present to do uh, so and then I just added these Mambisic letters and wrote the word so I really love this page, it's very neutral with some like blush pinks and some grey and light blue and just some black and I love how well it goes with these like holographic letters. So that's that and here I have my vision board for 2021. I have created three pages. So the first one here is like I really want to like put in an extra gear or what you can say uh, for my Instagram and my YouTube and uh, I want to take more beautiful pictures of course of things that I'm creating but I also want to take it to the next level so that's why I have these pictures here and this is dream and just added some like colorful big mambistic quotes loving these and all of these pictures are from Pinterest as well and of course I um, I want to buy an apartment and I want my own like crafting space I will probably not have an entire room for crafting but I want like a small office space like this is my dream I will show it to you I think that this is a Swedish design uh, furniture it's called string and I love it so much I have one shelf from that brand and I want this desk and like this cupboard uh, thing as well I think that this looks beautiful so I want something like this but also add some like greens I don't know what to call <laughs> some like flowers and stuff like that and just personal personalize it with some quotes and pictures and stuff like that so 
I'm really looking forward to be able to decorate a beautiful office space. And then we have this, as I said, I'm hoping that we could buy a new apartment or a new home this year. Uh, we've been living with my boyfriend's parents for almost two years now, that was not the plan. It was supposed to be like one year, but then Covid happened and Eric lost his job and stuff like that, so we had to wait. And now we're so ready, he got a new job, job and yeah. We're so excited and we are looking for apartments here in Stockholm. So hopefully we could decorate it and I'm really loving this like boho style. So that's what I want to create for our home. And then this is my goal page uh, for 2021. So I used like this paper is from the Happy Planner Memory Keeping Line, the cardstock, like with different papers. And I added these Mampy Stick like figures and or numbers. And then this is my gold page. So I added some like shimmer sprays, ink sprays, and like watercolor and I love it so much and also these are also Mambo Stick letters and I added a big sticker and here I have written down all my goals so now you can probably see all of them but like it's nothing too personal so I don't have any problem with showing it to you but I have like some social media as I said I want to grow my social media even more so I have some like followers, goals, and I also want to open an Etsy shop uh, for stickers or probably not stickers, but I want to create some printables. Uh, so that's a goal that I have for this year. And then I have some personal, like I hurt my back this summer, so I can't work out. And usually I have a ton of workout goals. Um, this time I'm having like walk four times a week because I need to move my body and I have rehab my back and I also want to run 10k because when I hurt my back during CrossFit I had to like rethink how I exercise and it's not like sustainable to <laughs> work out as much as I did so I wanna like focus my training on running and not only lifting heavy weights so that's why I have that goal and here we have the buy an apartment and also since my one little word for the year is presence I also have a goal to have one phone free day per week so that just includes like social media so every Saturday I will take a break from social media so that will be good for me to have no phone so that are the pages that I wanted to show you and I really loving these pages and I hope that these will like make me get to the goals that I set up for myself this year and like I love to make these kinds of pages very colorful because it makes me happy to look at them and if they make me happy then I will be more like it's a higher chance that I will actually look at my goals more often and be reminded of them and in that way it's more likely that I will actually reach them so yeah so that's what I wanted to show you and I really hope that you like this video and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please do that and I see you in a couple of days have a great week bye